Yeah. pieces. A fellow named Crendel was bragging about a map he stole from me. Was he lying? Crendel, eh? Belly crawling son of a forebear's cur. It was part of a map, supposedly showing the location of the flask of Lilandro. In my youth, I was something of a uh, treasure hunter. Do you remember what was on the map? Two numbers, an X, and the notation Long Tree. That's all I can remember. If you find it, keep it. I'm too old for such things. Maybe I can get Krendel to find it for me. Thanks for your help, Trit. Thanks, Trit. I've got to go. Surrender now! Put it down! Won't escape. Lad? Guard. What's this?
F is for the fleas that swarm within their shorts. You won't escape! Take that! You're open! Look alive! Look alive, Red Guard! my locket yet? Lakeen? Have you found my locket? Okay, Lakeen. Here's your locket. Now tell me the password. Oh, thank goodness! You got it! I'm saved! Never going back to that den again! No, sir. No more for me, but have your own go at it. The password you require is... Boon! Be careful, Cyrus, and thanks again. We'll talk later. What's a password? Spoon. Right, just a second. What's wanted, mate? Cyrus. Yurik. Welcome to the smuggler's den. What do you want? I'm looking for Azara, my sister. Apparently, she did business with you occasionally. That's right. She came by from time to time. Last time I saw her, she was after a piece of malachite for some reason. The Imperial occupation doesn't seem to have cramped your style much. Everyone needs smugglers, like it or not. For instance, Richton likes his veil and wood wine. Your league makes sure none of it arrives legally, and we make sure the palace cellar stays well stocked. <laughs> Everybody wins. Still, I'm surprised Richton gives you such a free hand. We have our uses. Like if you don't want the Emperor to know how much taxes you're actually collecting. <laughs> As I said, everybody wins. What would Azara want with that? Don't know. He sure wanted it bad, though. Traded me a League insignia for it. Said I could use it to get favors from the League. Ever yeah, since then, the League has vanished from Stros Mackay, so I'm stuck with a worthless piece of paper. I could use that insignia Azara gave you. Can I have it? Well, that depends. What's in it for me? You claim to be Azara's friend. I'm trying to find out what happened to her, and I need that parchment to do it. I never said I was her friend, just that I knew her. What makes you think I care what happened to her? I don't know. But I well then, look. Good uh. struck, eh, mate? You're gonna die down here. Uh. Uh. You're gonna die down here. Yeah. Too slow. Uh -huh. So, you want something? Now, about that insignia. Sure, sure, here you go. Listen, no hard feelings, huh? Of course.
Hmm. Five gold pieces. Is for the fleas that swarm within their shorts. I, I have some info that may concern you. I heard some boys talking that they had found your hidden map piece. That's impossible. They're just talking. Jealous of Crendel, they are. They, could, they couldn't know where it is. No, I'm, I'm not so sure of that. I overheard them say it had two numbers on it, an X and Long Tree. Didn't mean much to me, but I'd check your hiding spot if I were you. What? What? I mean, what? <laughs> then, um, another lie. Now go away, Cyrus. Following me. Hey, come on. Can a guy have some fun? Have some fun? Come on. What will be? I'll kill you! Come on! Excellent. Well? Cross with me! Come on! A health potion. Excellent. What's this? A leather pouch. And here's Trithic's map piece inside. Stop 
following me. Hey, come on. Can a guy have some plover? Have some plumber? Plumber fee. Private fee. Mac. You want. Where the hell is my sister? And who the hell are you? I'm Cyrus, brother of Bizarra, and I demand to know where she is. I'm the one asking the questions. How did you get into the lighthouse? One of your men, a prisoner of Richton's, gave me a key before he died of his wounds. And your code is keeping the local crazies up. Thrown into the catacombs you were. Well, you've been busy. I'm impressed by the escape. Just tell me where my sister is... now. It is not my place to give you that information. You'll need to talk to Basil, head of the Restless League. I know my sister is in the League. Now take me to her. I'm not sure why I am even talking to you. How do I even know you are who you say you are? I'm going to need some proof. Here's the proof you've been waiting for. A Restless League insignia from Azara. I don't know where you got that virus, but it will do. The insignia scrawled as such buys you at least an audience with the League. Climb on board. We're off before the Imperials know I'm here. Do you want? Where can I find Basil? I have no idea. Go ask someone and don't go poking your nose where it doesn't belong or you'll be sorry. Thank you. Don't thank me, Buster. Just get about your business. I have things to do. Later then. Locked. 
Where can I find Basil? He's over on West Dock. Just don't poke your nose until it doesn't concern you. Yes, yes, yes. There's the bastard that spoiled my raid. That was you? I remember two jokers who couldn't handle their sabers, but you must have been hiding. You see me now, though, don't you? Vanda. Plain as day, right here. Are you Basil? You're a hard man to find. Mystery Maintenance Alice, what do you want? We don't need to talk to him. Let me... Listen here, Spotlight. I'm not here for you. I know everything you have to say. Draw your sword anytime you're ready. Where is she? Wrong strategy this early in the dialogue, sir. The game is to find out what the other one knows first, not show how much of the map you can't read. Can he die now? Step off, Shiny. We'll get to that in a minute. I thought you were Azara's messenger boy, which would have granted a longer audience, but you're standing there looking like the last loose end of many. I'm Azara's brother, and all my loose ends have led me to you. She never mentioned a brother. And she's been part of us for a long time now. And from her omission of reference to you, I infer little pride or confidence in you. A judgment that seems well supported in the course of our brief and none too gratifying acquaintance. He has no idea where she is either. Shut up. He's got the same cordial manners as his sister, that's for sure. When and why would Azara have ever joined you? Did her association with you get her killed? There are some who can't admit a demise, who in the face of defeat create theories of retaliation. But the secret of theory is that truth doesn't exist. Azara disappeared appropriately into the very same void. I hope that meant something to you because it gets me no closer to Azara. I want to know what happened to her now. Wake up, sucker! We're thieves and we're bad guys, and Azara wasn't part of it whether you like it or not. In case you didn't notice, we're hiding out here. So it stands to reason if Azara isn't here, then she's in trouble. Don't you think the Empire might be able to help you solve this mystery a little better? You're wasting your time here. What kind of trouble would she be in? He can't help us, Basil. It's my turn now. Come on! <laughs> You're doing your best. Not this time. <clears throat> oh! <laughs> Damn! Very nice. Stupid! <clears throat> You win, I yield. Well, you want something? Speak up, boy. Don't be shy. I'm done with your bully, boy. Anna left him alive. And now the altruistic brother pup wants his bones. First, here's a bandage. Tidy yourself up, unless you were planning to use that sweet little puppy tongue to lick your wounds clean. You like breathing, Basil? Fine. Here's the key to Azar's Lodge. We've already ransacked it for clues to her whereabouts, but maybe you can find something we couldn't. Clues particularly in a journal, one we can't open. If you can tell me what's in the journal, I'll tell you what I know about Izara's disappearance.
You are wounded. Take this bandage. Thank you. For your goodwill and my spared life. That's better, much better. It's locked. It's locked. Yes, yes. It's locked. It's locked. I need to use this with something else. It's locked. Probably need to find something to use it with. It's locked. It's locked. Locked. Damn, better try something else. Must be Azara's journal. Looks like it's locked, but there's no keyhole. First C-26, Common Era, 864. This is my last entry, as I'm taking leave of this maddening torpor. The time to act is at hand. Basil and the rest of his lazy boys are content to mourn our prince and hide in shadows, even while we have the very thing the governor fears most. For months, my love has lain in amber, while the Empire affirms its hold. Hammerfell will be lost forever if Prince Ator is not restored. I'm decided. If the League can't shake its slumber, then I will steal the Soul Gem as they sleep. By morning, I'll be in Strath Mackay, where there are others who might give me the help I need. Cyrus, the gypsy woman told me you would come to Strath Mackay. I laughed in her face, of course, but I leave this warning if only for respect of one's elders. If the bloodlock is opened, then I know it is you, and I ask you to heed the next. Leave me my dilemma, and go back to whatever road you love best these days. You've had ample practice. Where is she? I don't know. I was hoping this would tell me. What do you know, then? When Azar joined the League, she changed its face. She gained us the attention of Prince Ator. Before Azar, we were a, a wild pack of nationalists with sharp swords and enthusiastic schemes. Our wanting reputation kept Ator from announcing an open affiliation, but we worked for him in secret. Removing forebear traders on the mainland and killing Imperial emissaries too long lingering at our borders. And then the war came all the way to Stros Mackay. Where Ator should have won. He had hunting spire with him that day. He would turn back Tiber Septum from Hammerfell forever. The League wasn't invited to join in the battle for discretion's sake. And we were forced to watch from afar. And at that battle we saw the face of a new empire. 
that sent a dragon that no man could stand against it. It killed Prince Ator? Ator challenged the beast, but he never reached it. A poisoned arrow from Rickton's henchmen failed the prince just as he rushed headlong to meet the dragon. What does this have to do with Azara? As Ator lay dying, his wizard, the Archmage Boa, tried desperately to save his life. The dragon was upon them and there was little time. Boa gathered Ator's life force into a soul gem just as the fire rained down. The Battle of Stros Makai ended then, and Azara's trouble began. Get to it. In another story altogether, the League got its hands on the soul gem. Reservoir, the Prince's power, and the narrative of wishful thinking began. The Restless League now had the means to bring back the Prince. We could restore Prince Ator from the Soul Gem, and under his banner, fight the Battle of Stros Makai again. This time right at his side. And then that little witch took it. Izara took the Soul Gem? And with it, the fate of Stros Makai. The Prince's spirit within that gem was the spark to ignite a revolution. When Izara stole the Soul Gem, she stole from us that fire. Where would she have gone with it? If we knew that, you wouldn't be here right now. The only reason we let you in the hideout was to find out what you know, or what this could tell us. We both seem to still be looking for our answers yet. I'll be back if you're alive, and I'll spare no one then. Find the soul gem, and you'll find his arm. Take me back to Stros Makai. This is bigger than your sister, Red Guard! Remember that? This is about the kingdom! This is about Hammerfell now! Damn fool. Maybe just the damn fool we need to find Azara in the Soul Gym. Maybe so.